Hello, everyone. Today, I want to introduce my research. The title of the research is the reliability and the validity of the brief SCF coset in patients with COPD. This picture shows the epidemiology of the COPD deaths in males in the world. Most of the mortality of COPD happened in developing country because of the city and the domestic pollution and the biofilm in domestic cooking and heating. We can see that China is one of the highest mortality countries. By 2030, COPD will be the third leading cause of death in the world by WHO prediction. A survey showed that 13.7% of people aged about 40 years old were affected by COPD in China. The SCF is composed of two parts, with functioning and disability and contextual factors. Functioning disability covers body, function, and structure, the activity and participation. Contextual factors consist of environmental factor and which impose the physical, social, and attitudinal categories. The personal factors that include gender, age, educational level, and so on. Personal factors with various categories are not included in the current SCF version. Body function and structure domains describe the impairment of anatomical and physiological function of different body systems. The activity and the participation domain refers to the limitation or difficulty an individual experience to perform a particular task in a certain environment and the restrictions to participate in life situation and interact with society. The contextual factors involve, involving environmental and the personal factors are linked to the first three domains. The brief SF code set has been widely used in various fields to evaluate function and a number of major assessment sets has been developed. This code set plays an important role in guiding clinical nursing and rehabilitation work. The first brief SF code set for obstructive pulmonary disease patients was developed, consisting of four components and 14 categories. Body functions involve respiratory functions, additional respiratory functions, exercise tolerance functions, and the sensation associated with cardiovascular and respiratory functions. Body structure involves the structure of cardiovascular and respiratory system. Activity and participation involve carrying out daily routine, walking, moving around, and doing housework. Environment involves products of substance for personal consumption, products and technology for personal use in daily living, climate and air quality. According to the conclusion of the former study, suggestions for improvement of the brief SF code set for COPD were put forward. Therefore, the aim of this study is to test the reliability and the validity of the brief SF code set for patients with COPD to provide an objective basis for its clinical application, which will lay the foundation for its further application in China. If you want to read more details about this paper, please read my article. Okay, thank you. Thank you for your attention.